think that nutty beat. Hi. Hi. We're four sevens of madness in London. And welcome to Countdown. I mean, that was a really big hit down in Australia and was the one that really broke madness down there. Can you tell us a little bit about the song itself? When was it written? It was when was it written? Well, we yeah. didn't write it. It was a Prince Buster thing. Right. It was a B-side of one of his records. We just did it for a laugh and it was really a hit everywhere because, you know, there's sort of nothing to it, really. It's just a foot stomping instrument. Right. <laughs> it's, who, a where, it's a toe tapping. It's a toe tapping. Where did the idea of the film clip come from? Because that was... Uh, film clip? And all the uh, choreography in that film clip. Oh, yeah. well. We had this nutty old American geezer who, who did a lot of videos with people like Devo and stuff, and he came right. on tour with us just for like four or five dates, and we just like do bits of film, we jump out of the van, and um, there was a lot more footage than was actually shown. Oh, he packed that right in. Packed that right up. <laughs> and uh, it was just sort of clipped all the best bits together. It wasn't really choreographed. Right. You know, yeah, was <laughs> and then we went back to London and did a sort of basic footage of us playing in a pub. So then we sort of linked it all together. Right. But it was just bits of footage of on tour. But <laughs> well, what are you away to answer a question? Yeah. yeah. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> um, baggy Trousers, again, it was a different film clip, um, yeah. but uh, and totally different, but a lot of fun. I mean, how long did it take to do that film clip? Really quick, only an afternoon. Yeah? All we did was, well, should we should give it away, our secret. No, no, no. I mean, how did you have him flying around there? Lee, Lee just flew, Lee's... Lee, just, yeah? Lee does actually fly, yeah, he, he, he can fly. No, we've got a new one now, which hopefully you'll be receiving. In right, I hear he flies into that as well, into yeah, the supers, I think, rather. Brilliant flying. <laughs> Going into jumping and flying and kicking things. And kicking things. Not, right. not the sort of Pink Floyd flying. Cuffing fucking pop stuff. Right. <laughs> right. Does it worry that you tend to become like a cult following as well? I mean, like where the, the, like the trade sort of, you know, pick you up as sort of being a certain image and suddenly people are sort of, you know, mimicking you? I mean, Mark, does it yeah. worry? Yeah. Yeah. I'm worried, worried to death. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't worried about it. You know, right. if they imitate us, it's the best form of flattery or something like yeah. that. Yeah. It's not right. good to be put in a bracket, though, a single sort of little... Well, that's what I'm saying. I mean, like the, the British uh, trade papers love to put uh, people, people in brackets. certain brackets. Yeah. Right. Well, I don't think they've really found one for us yet. So right. Good. Think. I mean, they, it depends. They vary each week if they like us or not. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> but yeah, it's just I don't know. We're just on our own. Work me, son. Work me. Yeah. So, uh, it's um, <laughs> you know the category we should be in is good, and they haven't found that yet. So. Look at that house. Have a quick shot of that house there. Oh, no, that's a really, look, look, look at this house. house. That's what you call yeah. English paintwork. That is high. OK, um, where a lot of bands that have sort of emerged over the last three years, like The Clash and The Jam, have found it very hard to gain national acceptance down in Australia, um, you sort of, sort of breezed in and have become one of the big groups down there. Um, when are you going to come? There, then. Very popular. Yeah. When are you coming down to Australia? Well, so April. April. Yeah. End of April yeah. is the... Well, like, there's a definite tour on. Yeah, they're yeah. trying to get it together for the end of April. We were going to come at the end of last year, but one of our... Well, our nutty comp here, Chance Smouse, had, uh, had his tonsils out, so he couldn't come. So, yeah, he was in hospital for a while. <laughs> So the end of we're April. really dying to come. We're dying. And what can we expect when you go into an in-concert type of situation, like a tour yeah. like that? How long are you on stage for? And well, about, about an hour. Because it but gets I mean, too boring any We've longer. changed a lot since the very start of it, you know, which you've probably seen in yeah. Australia. So hopefully we're going to try and do it as much as we were like then, you know, with the dancing and everything. Yeah. All right. But the scar, she's finished. No more Magnus the scar, no. We're <laughs> <laughs> finished. All right, listen, you like well. <laughs> thanks a lot for the interview, and um, and best luck with the. Uh, so I just jumped down. Um, best, um, best luck with the with there. the current single. All right, we'll see you soon. We'll see you soon in Australia. Australia. Oh, mom, she don't